everybody, welcome to Sober Healing. I'm on here to show you my favorite soup. I pretty much uh, make this every month, all year long. It's sweet potato butternut squash soup. And what I do, it's very basic. It's one butternut squash cut up, three sweet potatoes cut up. Okay, I boil it in water for about 45 minutes. That's about six cups in there of water. And then what I do is add some organic either chicken broth or bone broth. I use low sodium. And then I add, add a little bit of uh, sea salt and some pepper. And of course, my favorite ingredient on all my soups is balsamic vinegar. When that's been boiled down, you know, what I like to do is, it's kind of, you're gonna have to experiment with the way you like it because it can be thicker for some people and thinner. But what I do after I'm done boiling it is I use a stick blender. Now you don't have to use a stick blender. You can use a regular blender or you can just use a fork and mash it all down. You're going to have to experiment with how you like, you know, how you like it served. Me personally, I like to put steamed broccoli on top of every bowl and it just gives it a nice flavor. So we've got the thing boiling now. It's been about 45, 50 minutes. Uh, the last 15 minutes I left open, okay? I had closed it in the beginning. Now, it's time at this point to go ahead, add the balsamic. I want to show you about how much I add, okay? I don't add a lot. It gives it a nice color. It gives it, you know, you'll have to do it to taste. That's about how much I use. Probably two tablespoons, okay? Um, everything's getting extremely soft. You can see, very smushable. Breaking up. Okay, now, of course, the next important ingredient is the broth because you want to still boil it i use about a cup i get a lot out of this this is 32 ounces i get like three or four soups that i do out of this now at this point i already have seasoned it with the um salt and pepper i didn't use much salt at all i never do just a teeny bit um but now it's time to bring it back to a boil and then leave it for another 10 minutes boiling and then that's when it's time to go ahead and use your stick blender. Okay, we finished. So I just wanted to put it together for you. I've got a little bit in the bowl, but I want a little more. It's just, um, it's pretty thick, not too thick. It's, it's kind of runny, but you know, just right for me. Okay, couple of things of broccoli on the top. Just see the, the color, cause it's beautiful. There we go. Okay. Anyways, it's absolutely delicious. I've already tasted it. But I like it with the broccoli too. I like that added flavor. So I've got to teach, so I've got to let you guys go, but I hope you enjoy it. I hope you try it. This is the season. This is the fall. Squash is in, okay? All right, I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care.